Hello everyone. My name is Mahalishmi Kumarasamy from SDKT Kuala Pila. I would like to present my paper entitled Phonics Song to Improve Reading Skills Among Year One Pupils. So first of all, let us look at the statement of the problem. So this paper actually it started in the year 2021 where I was being given year English year one. So during the pandemic holiday in January and February 2021, I did online teaching and I found the student in year one were very active and also responsive. Therefore, I was really uh, thinking that I'm actually entering an active and responsive class. But I had a shock in the 1st March of 2021 where when I had a face-to-face -face class, I really observed that only five people were able to identify the alphabets from A until Z and only three out of 20 people were able to identify phonics of the alphabets. So therefore, my main issue is that the peoples are unable to recognize the sounds of alphabets and therefore, it will be difficult for me to teach them blending which will enable the pupils to read. So my main objective of this paper is to encourage the peoples to identify phonics from A until Z by end of December 2021 and this is because phonics is actually one of the basic skill that the pupils have to acquire so that they can improve their reading skills. So, my targeted group was only 10 pupils in year 1. Okay. And I actually used an excellent research which was based on Jane McNiff model in 2005 where it consists of 4 phrases in the cycle. So, the first is reflection, which I have done when I actually had a face-to-face -face, um, interaction with the students in March, 1st March 2021. And then what I planned is that I plan to use phonic songs, which I actually googled it up in YouTube. And I would play that phonic song. The title of the song is Phonic Song 2 where I will play them every time I enter the class for one month. And then I collected the data again on the effectiveness of the phonic songs. And I repeat step two again and again, which is I will play the phonic song again and again until the peoples acquire phonics from A until Z. So, and then what I did is uh, I gave the pupils a reading module to encourage the pupils to blend CVC words without teacher's guidance. Okay, so in this study, it is actually a quantitative um, excellent research where in the study, the application of the phonic songs was used as an intervention and also the data which is collected is uh, the instrument which I used is pre and post checklist and observation checklist and the data collected has been analyzed and interpreted in graphical form. And the finding of the study will be de will determine the effectiveness of the phonic songs for year one peoples. And based on what I've gained from this uh, research is that uh, the pre-test was conducted on 11 November 2021 and the post-test was conducted on 10 December 2021 and peoples were given alphabet charts to identify phonics of 15 out of 26 alphabets and one short CVC paragraph. So based on this true assessment, I scored pupils marks in a table, which you can see from here, all the 10 students and what are the scores in the pre-test and also during their post-test and the differences among it. So based on the data above, there is a significant difference between the score for pre-test and post-test. I calculated the differences between them and it shows that there are positive changes after this excellent research being held. And I also did an interview with the pupils to just to get the feedback by using the alphabet cards phonic songs 
and also the reading modules and I got a positive feedback from the pupils where they like to listen to songs and blending using actions and it is easier for them to recognize and memorize their alphabets. And through my observation from November until January 2022, I found my year one pupils were excited to see me and in the same time they were excited to learn English which is considered as a third language for them and they will wait for me to play the phonic song and they will automatically take out their reading module without me instructing them and I'm very delighted to see the positive changes among my year one pupils so in year end of the year school based assessment it also showed a positive increase among year one pupils in English language and uh, I'm happy to say that uh, in December, I only had three pupils who were still in um, TP1 and 2. So the rest of them all, the, uh, the students who are involved in this action research, they actually got TP3 and 4, where they were able to identify, recognize sound and blend words in English language. And... Uh, in conclusion, I strongly suggest English teachers, especially vernacular te uh, school teachers, uh, to use cards, phonic songs and reading modules in year one so that we can encourage the pupils to learn phonics and blend the words for CVC words without the assistance of teacher. And I also do emphasize that songs is actually one of the main um, instrument which year one English teachers should use so that the students will get excited and in the same time it will be efficient and beneficial for the students to learn English especially to vernacular students who are learning English as their third language. That's all. Thank you very much.